everybody and welcome to Visit Found Coast. We're on the Blackpool seafront at the moment. Well actually not quite on the Blackpool seafront because I've just bobbed around the corner of the, the counting house opposite North Pier to start this video because today we're going to take a look at the Yates's wine lodge site and the brand new hotel that's being built there because the scaffolding's down and it's nearly finished. So you can see the tower there, <coughs> we're facing the south, that's Blackpool Town Hall, look at the flag flapping. It's a little bit breezy, I've just walked along the promenade from where I've parked the car and I have had all on standing up, so hopefully this will not be too much interference from wind noise. So there it is in all its lovely splendid difference. We're going to go across the road in a moment to stand outside the town hall um, and have a look at it with the <coughs> with the sun on the other side. So you can see that it's in the, the art deco style of so many other buildings in Blackpool. We stood right in front of the lamppost. There's, a, there's an awful lot of street furniture. You think you could take it down, wouldn't you, while we just all get our photographs. Oh, and the clock's working as well. Five past ten, I like that. That's a whopper of a clock, isn't it? So that's the front of the building. We're going to go across the road now <laughs> and we're going to walk around the block because we visited this block on the 3rd of August. I'm looking to see whether there are any trams coming and the tram extension's not even completed yet. <laughs> Only me. <coughs> right, so we came, we came to Blackpool on the 3rd of August to film Yates's. Um, obviously, it's been a busy day. Windy, windy. Goodness me, I'm going to get one off my feet, I think, before I've done today. Oh! Um, and the scaffolding was still up at the time, and you can't see the front of the building either. So now you can see that all the new stonework's being revealed and it fills that triangular plot in between these two these two roads. This one is Clifton Street and the other one that we are just stood against is Talbot Road. We're gonna walk around the walk around the block and uh, go around the back of Abington Street and then <coughs> we've got we've got a sort of a before and an after to compare it to. So the new hotel is 150 bedrooms and a restaurant and a pub and apparently it opens on the 27th of November this year. So it's gonna be And the old Yates's Wine Lodge that you could probably remember went up in smoke on the 15th of February 2009. <coughs> so this is currently building, building central. All the builders have taken Clifton, Clifton Street over while they're doing what they're doing because obviously now they'll be finishing the internal fit out. So if it's not been on the 27th of November, they've only got, ooh, two months. So they're gonna need to get a move on, aren't they? <coughs> Goodness, <laughs> it literally is all builders, all builders vans. So the fire in February 2009 started at the pet shop and it went through the upper floors from the pet shop into Yates's. So you can probably remember the old um, Yates's Wine Lodge building with the rotunda on the corner. And the new one is designed to echo the style of the rotunda. So now we're on Adelaide Street. There's the Winter Gardens. It's a busy morning in Blackpool today. Oh, well, you want to know there's a wind, wind blowing here? This is the old post office, which is also being redeveloped. I've been to the street market. And we're going to go that away, 
around the back of the block, which is where we went when we did this video in August. So when Yates went up in smoke, it had just had a £500,000 refit, which is what you can only call unfortunate. There's a bus coming. <laughs> Goodness, it is busy in Blackpool. As I said, I've just walked on the seafront and it's so windy, it's deserted. You can't feel the breeze here. Totally, totally different. It's unbelievable. So that's the back of, that's the back of the building. And you might be able to see a sign on the wall there that says the old rock factory. This is the old rock factory here, which is a, a hive of creativity and art and screen printing and home to Robin Ross. So there have been various plans on the table for Yates's site since 2013, including mixed use, retail, leisure, all kinds of different things. And for one reason or another, for various <coughs> recessions and different things, nothing's nothing sort of managed to transpire. Don't forget to subscribe to the Visit File Coast. YouTube channel because that's where we're going next. That's where we're going to do our next video up there. We're going to Wilkie's, which is coming down and being demolished. So that's that's the next the next call this morning. So you need to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell for notifications as well. And then you'll know when we've uploaded new videos and we've been out exploring different places um, I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the ones that are not in the wind first <laughs> it's <really gale. laughs> it's been awful this week we had a a right performance yesterday at our, our house we had water coming in the patio doors and water running through the ceiling and I don't know, we had water everywhere, then the washer started leaking. So it was water, water everywhere and not a drop to drink. So I've, I've come out this morning while it's not too bad. And it's a little bit drier and, and sunnier. So now we're on Talbot Road. And this is the side of the building that we were looking at where we started. And I guess that's the main entrance. <coughs> it's just past these people. So this is obviously going to be the main entrance and the, if you like, the front of the building with these windows downstairs. the old um, Clifton Hotel is being renovated and didn't it need it and we're back at the town hall so that's your walking tour of um, the new Blackpool let me just let me just remember what it's called YouTube channel, hit that little bell for notifications, give it a like and if you've got any questions or comments pop them below and we'll see you in the next video. See you later, bye!